Hey guys, welcome back to Motivational Christians with Ezron. Guys, welcome back, welcome back. Today, we're going to be doing a video just showing off my daily routine, the Young Christian daily routine. I just want to show you guys how I to adjust my routine because of quarantine and a lot of stuff that I incorporate in my day to better myself, like meditation, going into my Bible, singing worship songs, and a bunch of other things that I do throughout the day. Uh, I do have my daily routine written down a list and then still this day I'm gonna just show you guys every single thing. Guys as you can see that's my daily routine. I'll I incorporate every single one of those things because they're important. Each day you gotta make sure you have a break just to relax yourself and just be able to still do stuff that you gotta do but also relax yourself. I have school that I gotta do so I'm making sure I do my school stuff. I still got to dwell into the Bible. I still got to do my meditation. So every single thing I need to do in the day is on that list. To begin, I'm going to do a meditation just, just to get my mind right for the day. And you guys are going to see that in the next clip. Oh, also, and guys, what I like to do is like with my meditation, I like to listen to some rain noises because it's just able to help me relax and set um, my mood for the day. Because now the time you wake up happy, like motivated and stuff, and the meditation just helps to put me in the right mind for throughout the day. guys we got a scripture isaiah chapter 54 verses 17 i'm gonna let it play for you guys no weapon that is formed against thee shall prosper and every tongue that shall rise against thee in judgment thou shalt condemn this is the heritage of the servants of the lord and their righteousness is of me saith the lord this is a very important scripture that i actually have memorized in my head no weapon formed against thee shall prosper Meaning that no weapon in anybody that come against you shall prosper because God have you all the way. He's going to continue to be with you each and every day. He's going to continue to protect you and guide you. And you just got to come along and be with God through every single thing. Because God can do his part, but you also need to do your part. Because a relationship with God is um a 50-50 relationship, which means that you put 100%, which is half of the relationship, I put a hundred percent, which is another half of the relationship, and fifty plus fifty is a hundred. So that hundred percent makes the relationship work. And, and I'm just gonna say a little prayer on this scripture, and right after this, I need to take a shower, then I'm gonna eat, brush my teeth, and start my schoolwork for the day. All right. So if you guys can, just buy a close eyes with me. Father God, we thank you for this day that you've made. I rejoice in the God of God. I pray that you continue to be with me each and every day. God. I pray that no weapon from me against me shall prosper, God. I pray that the scripture says, God. I pray that any enemy or any people that come against me, you'll be able to protect me from the God. Protect me from the, all, all the evilness, God. And keep me in a good mindset each and every day, God, to be able to do what you need me to do, God, to be able to also do the stuff on my to-do list each and every day, God, because I know each one of them benefit me, God, and make sure that I take my big show today so I'm able to also relax throughout the day and God, get frustrated with my work, God. I pray that you continue to love me and be with me, God. I pray that my audience that watch right now, I pray that you do the same for them, God. No way for engage them, so I promise, God, in Jesus' name, amen. Okay, guys, I'm going to take a shower, eat, brush my teeth, then get right into my school. See you guys in the next clip. Guys, I'm finished showering right now. It's about 8, 12. Uh, I'm gonna go eat now, brush my teeth after, then my class starts at 8.30. So I have about 18 minutes before school starts. And uh, yeah, I know I ain't really do nothing to my hair, but if I'm stuck in the house all day, I just don't attempt to do anything to it. But next week I'm gonna get it braided uh, so it could start getting to look back good. <laughs> See you guys in the next one. Well guys, right now I'm about to be in class, so I'll see you guys after I'm done with class. See you guys in the next class. Well guys, it's 12.35 right now. I just finished class. Uh, I'm about to go eat. 
I'm about to go eat now and then go right back to doing some um school work because like i said before i got some stuff that i need to finish later on the day we're going to do some promoting of my channel i try to do it every single day promote my channel uh looking at my to do list right now i gotta read a book after that because i also make sure i read reading is important and it's always good to do so i make sure i read every single day i do read my bible and this other book called touch for men it's basically a bunch of like topics relating to men but I have bible scripture with it so it's like a bible but not a bible at the same time so i basically read like three sets of books during the day and right now i'm reading this book by walter dean myers i actually like i love his books uh and yeah see you guys in the next clip got the sausage right there the sausage was finished got a little burnt in it we got our dorito to put inside you gotta make sure you eat ketchup with it and then we have our cheese and then i'm going to show you guys the ending product Right now it is uh, 134 if you can see uh, if you can see I'm just gonna finish off my some school rate that I need to finish Wait, off look at the mind. next clip hey guys this is the mat rig I'm about to get into right here okay guys I just finished my school work now I'm over here promoting my channel if you guys wonder how do I promote my channel I'm about to show you guys right now but uh there are actually facebook groups where you can promote your channels and these are the three facebook groups i'm in youtube subscriber free promotion youtube subscriber promotion channel and i actually go in there and promote my channel to to get more people to hear the word i do that I make sure i do that every single day so that way more people could come and hear the amazing word of god right after this i'm gonna get into the time of reading i'm not gonna well guys i just finished doing the promoting of my channel now i'm about to go into this book the book that i'll be reading is called hoops it's by walter d Myers. if you guys want to check that book out i recommend it it's a really good book to read i'm going to show you guys the cover just in case you do not know Okay, guys, I just finished reading. Uh, now, I'm, it's chill time. From 4 to 7 is usually the time that I chill. I don't got nothing to do. I'm just over there, just going to chill. And just, like, relax. Because you always got to have some free time during the day. At 5 o'clock, I got to go outside and do my my garbage duty. Uh, if you don't know what, what the garbage duty is, I basically got to pack whatever garbage is. Whatever regular garbage is at the back. And just put it outside so tomorrow the gravity check will collect it at five i'm gonna do that uh i'm gonna do some i'm actually gonna do some workout today i'm gonna do some light stuff i'm gonna just do push-ups not nothing really big okay then, guys right now i'm about to go do the garbage i'm not gonna film any of that because i don't feel like you guys need to see me touching trash or whatever so i'm just not gonna film that but when i do get back upstairs i need to work out and what i do when i work out i listen to motivational speech because it just encouraged me to just continue to fight through it today i'm just gonna do push-ups i'm gonna do 40 push-ups and see how how long it can take me to do 40 push-ups and i just hope that you guys just keep are uh, still enjoying this video watching it i got the light on me you know i'm glowing i'm getting my hair braided next week so don't worry this is not gonna be here next week so just see you guys in the next clip let's get it okay guys i'm ready i got my phone right here it's gonna um time how long it takes me to do these 40 push-ups got my motivational speech ready and we're getting to this if you guys want you can also do this at home right now and let's see all right i'm about to start <clears throat> one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 
11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 30, 36, 37, 38, 39. <coughs> God, I did 40 push-ups in 34 seconds. Ooh, but we got these push-ups done, 40 push-ups in 34 seconds. I'm excited because the last time I did 40 push-ups in like a minute, and that was back in August, so you know I'm going crazy. My workouts during the day are actually longer than this. It's like 20 to 30 minutes. But today I just wanted to do something light. I wanted to do over, do it. But we're gonna get right back into just doing some whatever, whatever stuff because I still got break time right now. My break time's end at seven, and it is 5:34. So I have I hour and 26 minutes to just chill. And see you guys in the next clip. Let's get it. Okay, guys, it's dinner time now. I'm going to start, go get my food ready. I'm going to eat some bread with some beef patty. Beef patty, obviously, will have cheese in it. Uh, and ketchup. I will put some barbecue sauce, but we don't have barbecue sauce. And I don't know about you, but I like eating beef patty with barbecue sauce. It tastes really good. And I'm going to show you guys what I'm about to eat in the next clip. Let's get it. Guys, I just finished eating dinner, and now I'm just relaxing. It's like 7.32 now. From 7.30 all the way to 9, that's for last time. I'm just going to do whatever. Most likely just watch YouTube with it. Might play a game. I don't know yet. But 9 o'clock is when I'm really going to start my worship and some other stuff. And then after that, we're going to meditate and then get straight to editing this video. I'll see you guys in the next clip. Okay, guys, 9.03 right now. We're about to get into this worship time, read the book Touch for Men, get into the Bible plan, and study for my permit test. Let's just get straight into every single thing. No further ado. And guys, for copyright reasons, I cannot play any of the Christian songs because if I play them, I'm going to get a copyright strike on their video. So for copyright reasons, I cannot play the songs, so and that's why I got my headphones on. Let's go. Father God, we thank you for this day that you've made. I rejoice in the God of God. We thank you for continuing to be the God and the fire that you've been for these years, God. I pray that now as I'm about to get into this time of worship, God. I pray that my wish should be accepted unto you, God. I pray that you'll be able to feel glorified. You'll be able to feel lifted up, God. I just pray that no one perform against me shall prosper, God. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, guys, we just finished worship. We're going to pray and then get into this Bible plan. Father God, we thank you for the day that you've made. I rejoice in the God, God. I pray that you continue to be with me each and every day, God. I pray that I know if I'm going against me, so I'll prosper, God. I pray that you help me through the highs, the lows, the goals, and the come out each and every way, God. I just love you. I thank you for continuing to just be in there with me, God. I pray that I'm about to get to this Bible plan, God. I pray that be some key information in there, God able to need and learn and understand God and I just pray I'll be able to remember it and apply it some way somehow in my life God in Jesus name Amen okay guys we're gonna be diving into this Bible plan now it's called discovering wisdom hope you guys can see that discovering wisdom I'm on day two right now and we're gonna get into it This is 
actually was a really good plan. Told us about how we let the outside world of this world influence our wisdom instead of letting God influence our wisdom. Because God gives wisdom and knowledge. and We should let our wisdom and knowledge come from God. Amen. I'm going to pray on that. Father God, I thank you for this day that you've made. I rejoice and make it, God. Father God, you're holy, you're worthy, you're mighty, God. You are Jehovah God, the Lord, who's my provider, God. I pray as now as I just finished reading that plan, God. I pray that the wisdom and knowledge that I have will be coming from you, God. I pray that I won't let myself get the wisdom and knowledge from of this world, God. I pray that I get it from you, God. You only Jehovah God, the Lord, who's my provider, God. I love you, God. I thank you, God. I pray as now as I'm about to get into this other book, God. Touch for minutes, God. I pray that I'll be able to point out a good topic and be able to understand it and be able to discuss it. In Jesus' name, amen. Now we're going to be reading Touch for Men. I really like this book and I recommend this book for men. They do have it for women. I'm not sure about kids, but I know they have it for women too. I recommend this for any men or teenager. I recommend you get this book. Today we're going to be talking about burnouts. Let's talk about burnouts. I haven't done that yet because I check off each each one of the each one of the um topics that I went over as you guys can see it's a lot of checks because I've went through a lot of the topics already. Today we're gonna be doing burnouts that's on page twenty six. Yeah, I just finished reading burnout. Let's talk about burnout. It's very important. We all experience burnouts in our life, but we just got to turn to God. God will give you all the strength that you need to go through any situations in your life. To trials, tribulations, burnouts, anything. God will give you the strength to handle it. I'm going to pray on this, then I'm going to get into studying for my perimeter. Father God, I thank you for the day that you've made. I rejoice in God. God. I pray that I just finished reading that topic on burnout, God. I pray that anytime I'm experiencing burnout, trials, tribulations, God, I pray that I always turn to you um, so I can get my strength from you, God. Because I know that my strength comes from the Lord, God. I pray that you continue to be with me each and every day, God. I just pray that you continue to help me. Bring me for any sins that I've committed throughout the day, God. I praise you. I love you, God. And Jesus, bless me, God. Amen. I pray now to do the studying for this permit test and with you. Well, to the test, I got a well, this is basically like a practice of, I got an 8 out of 10. Good enough. Could do better. Could do better. No, 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 I got a 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10, I got a 7 out of 10. Okay. Okay, guys, now I'm about to get into time of meditation. This meditation is basically to reflect on my day. Expect on the highs, the lows, uh, the good things that I did, the things that I did I probably should have done in different ways, things I probably shouldn't have done. You know, just to reflect on the day and so I can improve on the following day. And, like, I suggest everybody do that. I always try to reflect on your day at the end of the day. So that way, the following day, you can improve on whatever mistakes, the thing that you probably did wrong. I listen to rain noises while I'm doing it because it helps to calm me. But... You can listen to whatever your heart chooses to do with it. I I just listen to rain noises.
Okay, guys, it hasn't been 20 minutes, but it's only been 8 minutes, but, you know, I'm done. Sometimes, it may, I just may take the whole full 20 minutes, and sometimes, I may not. Today is a perfect example of that, because my day was pretty much, pretty much like same. It wasn't anything really new to my day. Well, except for recording, recording my, my daily, my daily routine, because... I haven't done that before. Uh, and in a way, you could call this a vlog. I would say not really, but in a way, you could call it a vlog because I pretty much vlog my whole day. If you made it to the end of the video, thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for coming back each and every week watching these videos. Thank you for liking them. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for every single thing. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow. Bible study is going to drop Saturday. This is Motivation for Christians. Yeah, I just run. I'm out. Peace.